Hey guys, I'm Julia. We are here at NAM 20 and next to me there's a wonderful Richard Boner. Thank you so much for your time and for being here. Thanks for having me here. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. How are you doing with your hand? I was so uh, concerned because in How September, you know? yeah. yeah, you posted a video on oh, yeah, Instagram yeah, 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 yeah. and I, 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 it was the same time I broke my wrist and I was oh. like, Oh no, his finger! And yeah, how is it my, going? It's, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's not a one hundred percent, as you know. Yeah. When you break like a bone like that, you know. I yeah. know. I and know. plus, I didn't rest. You know, actual rest. You know, when you break a finger, you know. But I didn't take enough time to rest, so I kept playing. Same, on, same, same thing. thing. Same thing. <laughs> so they said like the fingers doing good now. Yeah, you know, it's yeah. at eighty percent, so just, it's uh, getting better. Okay, it's, okay. It's getting better. Yeah. I'm glad. <laughs> um, I also want to talk a little bit about playing solos because I'm so in an awe when I see you or hear you play solos. It seems like it's let's just right in the moment. Mm. There's not a lot of muscle memory, just what you have or what you hear first you're playing. It, it seems like that. Yeah. So. How do you get there, or what do you feel when you, or what do you think when you play those solos? Mostly, actually, I don't really think. Uh, uh, it's an extension of my uh, my singing abilities, if I could, you know. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. uh, uh, you play like you sing, or you play, or you sing like you play. You know, mm -hmm, it mm -hmm. goes both ways. So, uh, uh, to me, it comes. I'm just following my singing path. Solos are not uh, uh, things that we kind of, you know, going down and think of each note, going trying to place this note here. We just we just let the fingers all go out there. We practice so much that uh, instantly, you know, it, 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 it finds a way. Yeah. I don't know how. Yeah, it's yeah. hard to describe what it is. I don't know what I'm doing the next second, but yeah, it's gonna yeah. happen. Yeah. What makes it? I think it's a practice. It's practice. Yeah. Over time, you make it your own language. Too. Yeah. You know, all the solos we learn from uh, masters that uh, yeah. uh, uh, we had in front of us, uh, uh, or music that we liked. At the end of the day, we we kind of transform this music into our own music mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and put our own heart in it. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, we kind of steal this from the, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, the the person who made it and and create our own little world into yeah, it yeah. and that's the beauty of music is uh music is such of a sharing you know mm -hmm. once you put something out there it's no longer yours it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's so much is coming back yeah I know. it's for everybody yeah and exactly. uh, I, I wish life uh, people's life had a reflection of music mm -hmm. there's so much sharing in, in music <laughs> You see, so all those things that we practice for so long, mm -hmm. remember there's only 12 notes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> At the end of the day, <laughs> there's only 12 notes. Yeah. And, uh, you make up, you know, you make up with, that's the magic of music. Yeah. It's so beautiful and you can't really explain it. It's only 12 notes. Yeah, yeah. Less than an alphabet, less than uh but look, look at all this creation. Yeah. Look at all these forms of music. There's something with less things and we could do this. I get to meet people uh, that I don't know. But when we start playing, it looks like we know each other. Yeah. In it's real life, it takes politics like five years to even sign a deal or start talking or building bridges. Or something. But in music, instantly right there, we signing this deal now. Because yeah. <laughs> yeah. it's got a groove, baby. Yeah. <laughs> How do you do that with your voice and playing at the same time, like the coordination? Um, because it's so, it seems like it is so independent like both voice and playing at the same time. Not the same thing, yeah. but because sometimes there are really complicated rhythms. <sighs> so the way I practice. did it was, uh, <laughs> we come back to practice. Yeah. You want to be good at doing something, 
anything in life. You want to be good at doing something, do it all the time. So what I did, each time I play an instrument or I learn an instrument, I always play and sing at the same time. Mm -hmm. You know? That's how I learned each instrument. I play organ, balafon, guitar, bass, saxophone. That's how I learned. I learned all these instruments singing at the same time. Because I come from singers, my mother's singer, my grandfather's singer, so uh, I just kind of uh, I didn't even know that I was developing that side of uh, accuracy mm -hmm, between mm -hmm. the vocal and the thing. I just like to sing mm -hmm. and play at the same time. Mm -hmm. So now, as I grew up, I realized by doing that so much that wow, I actually don't need my 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 bass if I want to learn a bass line. Mm -hmm. yeah. If I hear a bass line, bam, do do. I know all the positions. It has a bad side too. Because by that, I develop a perfect pitch. So that when I listen to music, I analyze everything now. Okay. <laughs> sometimes it's not about analyzing why you want to... And I blame myself sometimes. Because yeah, I'm listening to things, I'm like, okay. Okay, so it diminish. And then goes, I'm like, so, oh, I'm like, why? Why is it good? <laughs> why is it or oh, something? Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Oh my God. And I'm like, and all the time, the moment you play music, my brain started to analyze everything. I mean, I heard all, all your albums, and there are a lot of strings or orchestra things yeah. sometimes. And did you do like all the writing for the string section? By no, orchestration is something I don't know. Uh, 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 I took some classes after a while, but so busy now. It's like I write all those strings on the keys myself, uh, okay. and then I call in the, uh, I call someone like a Gil Goldstein or, or somebody who know how, how to orchestrate this. Because mm -hmm. you know, I'm, I, I played all those things on the yeah. keys, but I, I won't tell which one the viola should be, or the violin, or the cello, or yeah, yeah. How to uh, orchestrate some, yeah, orchestrate it. It's a different, it's a different thing. And what are you going to do the next days? Are you going to be at NAM like every day? I'm here because, uh, yeah. Uh, You're going to play at Marcus? I designed a bass, yeah. yeah. And I got my MPA, the Little Ninja, that came out in 2018, actually. So I have a new bass that came out last year. Uh, the distribution starting uh, very soon, Yeah. like uh, in a month. Oh, wow. We're waiting for the name to, to make an announcement yeah, after that. Course, yeah, of course, of course, of course. Then... You can find on the Toman. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, thank you very much for oh, your thank time. You. Thanks a lot for And me. for all your inspiration and of course your music. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Pop to do and do 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 do